This is a video tour of the property 9 Allens Bank Crescent. This is a six bedroom house located just off Whitchurch Road. Um, very good location for Heath Hospital um, and Cardiff Metropolitan uh, University students. So as we enter the property, um, first of all on the left hand side you have room number one. Um, so this is a double room where you've got a double bed frame and mattress provided by the landlord. Um, the storage units over here that you see and also a desk and desk chair. TV belongs to the current tenant. Lots of natural light comes through when you do open the blinds with the light on. There we go. So this is room number one. We then have room number two located to the middle ground floor. So very similar size, if um, anything, a little bit smaller than the first bedroom. But again, you've got a double bed frame and mattress, desk and desk chair, and then storage space. If you did want to reconfigure the rooms, you're more than welcome to. You didn't have to keep it laid out exactly how it is right now. This one overlooks the rear of the property. Moving through the property then, um, you've just got some extra storage underneath the stairs here if you did want to use it. Uh, you've got one separate toilet. So in here you've got just the toilet and wash basin and mirror. In the communal areas, um, so this has just changed. Um, the landlord has just knocked this wall through to make it an open plan kitchen living area. Um, so in your kitchen, you've got white goods in the way of a dishwasher, washing machine with a drying function on it. Um, you've got integrated gas oven and hob, and then two fridges and freezers. Plenty of cooking and storage space in here. Overlooks the rear, which I'll show you in a minute. And then this is the um, sort of kitchen, uh, living dining area. So you've got two sofas provided by the landlord, table and chairs, and also the TV provided um, to the communal area as well. So in the back garden, um, this property's got lovely astro turf in the rear. Uh, so here we are. So in the summer months, this is lovely. Um, you can use this to play some football if you wanted to. You've got the uh, washing line as well and just some extra storage in the shed uh, if you did have a bike or anything that you wanted to store in there. So moving back through the property then. To the first floor are three more bedrooms and another bathroom. So as you go up the stairs, you've got room number three, which again overlooks the rear of the property. This is the smallest room in the house, so if you're happy with this size room, then everyone is happy. You've got a wardrobe, desk and desk chair, and storage space. Overlooks the rear gardens. So again, this can be reconfigured if you wanted to lay the room out differently. then got the separate shower room and you've got a shower cubicle just here wash basin so the toilet to this is um obviously downstairs underneath the stairs we've then got room number four another good size room with all the storage chest of drawers Got a double bed frame and mattress again, desk and desk chair overlooking the rear. So this is quite a you know normal size room, I would say, not particularly small or anything like that. And then you've always got the big room at the front of the property. Um so when the windows open, you get lots of natural light coming in here, and um, thanks to there being two windows. Um, again, landlords provided desk and desk chair and storage space. This is um, certainly the best room in the house. 
screen number five. And then moving on up the stairs. We've got another bathroom, first of all. So here you have, again, a shower cubicle, toilet and wash basin. And just next door to that, we've got um, the sick bedroom. So here you've got a double bed frame and mattress, chest of drawers, and added storage space just here. And there's also wardrobe, desk and desk chair. So if you're interested in this one, then give us a call.